You've started on your path and your journey with self-improvement. You've probably seen some videos like why you should meditate every single day, why you should do gratitude journaling, right? And all those things are well and good, but what if I was to tell you that if you don't do those things correctly, then your success is not guaranteed. So in this video, I'm going to give you a five-step guide on how to fix your life and ensure that you have the certainty that you will fix your life. And with that, the first step is going to be developing your habits to be beneficial for your life and your future. See, when we talk about habits, we break those down into two different sections. First section is going to be instant gratification. These instant gratifications are habits that are like um, eating some type of sugar, right? Maybe a dessert, maybe having some sort of pleasure when you're pleasuring yourself while you're watching certain videos, right? Maybe it's scrolling on TikTok, right? And getting that dopamine hit every time you scroll. See, this is instant pleasure, instant gratification. See, what instant gratification does is it triggers your dopamine to where now you need more. See, because us as human beings, we never become satisfied with things. It's uh, very similar to a slot machine. Every time you pull that machine, you get a dopamine hit. Whether you win or lose doesn't matter because when you pull again, you get another dopamine hit. See, what we instead want to do is we want to do habits that are delaying your gratification. See, it's pushing things out. It's basically making sure that your habits today make your future better than your life today. See, we are pushing away that gratification. We are delaying it because inevitably you're going to build yourself better today. You're going to learn the skills, you're going to fail so your future can be the best it can be. And so what we need to do is instead switch those habits with delaying gratification instead of instant gratification. Which brings us to our second step, fixing your influences. We are the average of the five people that we hang around the most. Nowadays in modern technology, you are the average of the five people that you pay the most attention to. So that could mean going on podcasts, listening to people, and whenever you are listening to these people, make sure that they're people that you aspire to be like. See, if you're listening and watching these people who maybe are not the best figures, maybe um, you just don't look up to these people, you just find them entertaining and amusing, that's probably not the right influence. It's probably not like the people that you want. So your subconscious is far stronger than most people think. And if you are putting influences in that that are not beneficial to your life and your future, then you don't need to do that. And instead you need to swap those with people that are good. And with that comes the third step, which is your mind. Fixing your mind and ensuring that you have the mental health and mental capacity to push through difficult things will ensure that you are actually going to achieve the life that you want and fix your current life now. See, your mind is everything. Your mind should be in control. If you constantly are craving sugars, craving sweets, craving food, then what's happening is your body is in control. When you crave that food and then you go and you eat it and you satisfy your body, now you are training your mind that, hey, my body's in control. When my body says tells me what it wants, then my brain should listen. That's wrong. And so when you get those cravings, when you get those that hunger to go do something, whatever it may be, you need to make sure to understand that, okay, is this going to be beneficial for my future or is it not? See, is this a need or is it a want? That sugar is not good for me. I'm not going to eat it. You are not going to get that inside of your body. You will not get the sensations because my brain, my mind is in control. Which then brings us to our fourth step which is making sure that you have a purpose, some sort of drive, because if you are going to reduce those sugars and you're, if you're going to cut out a lot of these uh, instant gratification, instead go for the delayed gratification, you need to have something in your future that you are looking forward to. See, if you are just doing this for yourself and this is all selfish reasons, you will not ultimately get to your goals, right? Think about it. Have you ever had uh, maybe a friend or a family member who's counting on you to do something? See that that when people count on you to do stuff, you don't want to let those people down. It's the same thing when it comes to your purpose and your mission. For me, I personally want to help men all across the world ensure that they are seeing the best in their health, wealth, and relationships. That is my purpose. That is what I am here to do. And you are exactly who I'm talking to. I want you to understand that you have the ability to change, that you can do these things. You can implement them in your life today and ultimately see a better life tomorrow. But you need to have a purpose. What is your why? What is the reason why you were doing this? And it cannot be for yourself. Use some external factor. Maybe it's your future wife 
life, your future kids, maybe it's your mom, your dad, you wanna make sure to retire them because they took care of you when you were a kid, right? Whatever the reason may be, make sure that you have some sort of purpose and reason why you're doing this stuff. And the last step to fix your life today is taking action simply going out and doing things. See, we get in this constant analysis paralysis where we're watching videos, we're figuring out what we need to do. Like we need the perfect guide, the perfect step in order to get there. And while this is five steps guiding you to there, you still have to take action. You still have to do what we talked about in this video. So go out, do it. If you enjoy this video, hit that subscribe button. And if you want to see a specific reason why you need to take a step in the right direction, go ahead and click this video right here.